Hi guys, it's James. So, as I mentioned in my last video, I went up my mum's loft and tidied out everything up there and brought it all down. She's moving house, so uh, as I said, I'll do a quick video. We're going to sort through it, what's for the bin, what's for car boots, and what's worth reselling on eBay. So, I'll just flip the camera around and, and I'll do a quick show around. Right, so here we go. So, like I said, I think a lot of it's going to be tat for the bin, or we're going to do a car boot this weekend to get rid of a lot of it. So, just an old style suitcase there, uh, just a CD rack or bookshelf. So loads of these old uh, tools. I tend to see these every week at the car boots, and uh, they don't seem to sell, to be honest. So whether there's anything in there worth anything, I don't know. Uh, just a bit of old crockery. Don't think there's worth anything in there particularly. Uh, there's some scale electric accessories in here. So kind of all the fencing for for scale electric. Uh, just a little box box of there. Um, proper scale electric box there that should have a car in it, but it's empty. Um, just a face steamer, these all go to a car boot, a broadband um, thing there, and then there's a huge box full of Colby toys, or cars here basically, so like I say, most of them are absolutely battered, uh, there's no roof on that one, like I say, there's, they're just in terrible condition, but whether there's any, any value in any of them, a little uh, Ferrari there. Uh, like I say, I think they're all, you know, decent makes, all like corgis or, you know, half decent toys. So I don't know how to sort through that and uh, and see what's what. But like I say, there's just there's just so many in there to to kind of go through. So what I'll do with those, I don't know. Uh, guitar that'll go to the car boot of the weekend. Um, Xbox 360 arcade. <laughs> Shift that guitar out of the way. Um, there's no Xbox in there, unfortunately, but it's a mint box. Still got the Xbox itself, but when I do come to sell it, at least I've got a mint box for it. Uh, a load of old jewellery. Uh, that's that'll be my mother's. Uh, into this room, there's more. Um, just an iron. A bit more crockery in there. Just bits and pieces like these kind of travel plugs. That that might be worth something. A, a timer plug. Um, in here, I've got hundreds. Well, tens of uh, PlayStation games, but unfortunately, uh, they're all copies. Um, so someone's had a, a chipped PlayStation somewhere at some point, but like I say, there's four drawers full there, full of uh, chipped PlayStation games. So whether I get away with trying to sell them on a car boot or not, I don't know. Um, this is an old uh, typewriter, portable electronic typewriter. Not sure if there's any money in that. Again, a few, just a few electricals, a really old printer there. Juicer, uh, that's a whole fruit juicer, so again, that'll go to the car, but it's not worth posting that, it's massive. Um, loads and loads of my old clothes, so again, all this needs going through. Loads of this has still got the, the tags on it as well, so again, I'll go through that and see what's worth selling and what's worth going to, to car boots. There is actually an Xbox in this one, so <laughs> I found this one up the loft and it's, it's got an Xbox 360 in there, so I might get a little bit of money for that. Uh, I'll have to check whether it's working, it's probably... Probably not to be honest. Like I said, this is all all clothes, old shoes in here. Uh all bit tatty to be honest, so loads of that'll be going in the bin. Uh this is really good. Um this is probably one of the best things I've found up there. So it's uh an old Le Mans scale electric, so absolutely massive box of scale electric and it's all in there as well. So whether that's uh, gonna be good enough to post or you know how I'm gonna post it if I do sell it, that's um that's a question there, but like I said, I'm sure there's some, some money in that. Um, an old steering wheel for, I think that's a PlayStation steering wheel, might be a bit, a bit of money in that one. Uh, just a few board games. Um, that's a Guitar Hero guitar in there. Still in the box it came in when it was delivered, uh, so that's really good. Um, just, again, a load of old kind of tat in there, juggling balls. Um, just little kind of Simpsons toys, that kind of thing. Maybe a little bit of value in that, I'm not sure. Um, a little bit of Lego Technic. Again, should be able to sell that on. Old computer stuff, so mouse, keyboard, that kind of thing. That'll probably just be good enough for the bin. Uh, and then, like I said, there's a load of board games, so I'll quickly go through these. Dingbats, Yahtzee, I have never, no idea what that is. Game of Life. Pictionary, Atmosphere, Escape from Atlantis, Campaign, that one I can't even say, Cluedo, Triad, Othello, Horror House, Play Your Cards Right, uh, there's a Fibber down there, Screwball Scramble and something called September, so again, all those board games to, to go through, so 
mountain and board games there. And then the last thing in here is uh, just a few different things from my childhood really. So in this ice cream tub, uh, if anyone remembers them or has anyone seen them before, uh, boglins. So again, there's probably 20, 30 boglins in, in there. So again, whether they're worth anything, I'm not sure. Uh, if there's any resale value in them, but I can say they were quite expensive. I remember at the time they were quite expensive when I, when I bought them as a, a child. So hopefully there's some money in those. Uh, and in this box I've got a load of old wrestling figures. I used to be into my wrestling when I was little as well. So they're all, you know, in, in pretty some, decent condition. They're all the Mattel ones as well, so they are really good. Um, Earthquake there, if you remember him. Typhoon. I can't remember what these are called. But yeah, they're all really without focus. But yeah, there's probably, again, probably 20, 30 in there as well. Ultimate Warrior. You can tell my ear of <laughs> when I used to watch it, uh, to be honest. So yeah, hopefully there's, there's quite a bit of stuff there I'll be able to get uh, get one to eBay. Uh, like I said, we'll do a car boot this weekend, and I, I think there'll be you know quite a bit of money in the car boots. And I've got some stuff that's not really shifting on eBay myself that I'll, I'll put on there as well. So yeah, quite, a, quite an interesting haul. It's just a... Uh, going to be quite time consuming now going through it all and seeing what's what and what's worth keeping so yeah if anything uh, you see on there is you think is worth you know money that I haven't noticed then please please do comment uh, like I said I'll, I'll get sorted now and hopefully do an update when I've sold some of it to, to let you know how it goes thanks again guys